guys! What's up? Alpha Lion Simba here, and welcome to another creature comparison. It's time once again to go back to prehistoric times. And for the first time, I'm talking about pterosaurs, because I'm gonna do Pteranodon, or Winged and Toothless, versus Ornithochiris, or Bird Hand. So, let's begin. As always, we start with our similarities. First up, both Pteranodon and Ornithochiris were large pterosaurs that lived during the Cretaceous period. Uh, more on that later. And they both mainly ate fish and other aquatic animals. And they both tended to nest in large colonies. Now then, let's talk about the differences. First up, Pteranodon lived much later than Ornithochiris did. Pteranodon lived 89.8 to 70.6 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. Ornithochiris, on the other wing, lived 136.4 to 93.5 million years ago during the early to mid-Cretaceous period. Also, Pteranodon lived in what is now the western United States, while Ornithochiris lived in what is now modern-day Europe and Central Africa. And obviously, their heads look very different. Pteranodon had a long, bony crest on the back of its head, and its beak had no teeth in it, hence the name, Pteranodon which means winged and toothless. By contrast, Ornithochiris didn't have a crest and had teeth in its beak. And while they both weighed about 44 pounds, Pteranodon had a bigger wingspan at about 30 feet, depending on species and gender. Female is two-thirds that of the male, while Ornithochiris had a 16-foot wingspan. Well, that was it. My creature comparison on Pteranodon and Ornithochiris. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave requests in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Now, let's go back to the safari hat and see what our next creature comparison is going to be. Shall we? All right, let's see, here we go. Mm -hmm. Well, we're gonna be heading to the wilds of Africa to hear about two very fascinating species of antelope. Alpha Lion Simba, out.